gonna do this vlog a little differently. explain or at least try to I am not prepared the way I thought I was gonna be for what's about to happen mm, nope not prepared I had a list of things oh here it is I am prepared I was gonna say I had a list of things that I was to discuss with you guys and now I can't find it but I just did been wearing a mask all day so let me get my lips moisturized oops uh, just a little Fenty just a little Fenty gloss okay so we are headed home and as I said I have a few topics to discuss with you all. Ugh. Starting route to I don't um I know how to get home. I just don't know the best way to get home yet. And it varies with each day because this is Atlanta. So just because this is the way you took on Tuesday doesn't mean it's the way you take today. Okay. So the objective today is to talk to y'all while I'm on my way home because I realized that the little bit of vlogging I have done this week, it's maybe three minutes worth of video, <laughs> maybe, maybe eight because I did a little mini vlog, which I may insert here, I may insert later. I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to go about doing this, but all of that to say there's not enough beautiful bean footage for a real vlog and I didn't really realize that until yesterday which was Wednesday and I was like oh no <laughs> this is no bueno so here we are today hold on hold your mule hold your mule that's country talk Thank mm -hmm. you. 
list of topics to discuss with you guys. I mentioned something about uh, possibly going live on YouTube, but when it came right down to it, I just didn't feel comfortable. <laughs> I was like, what if I do it and then nobody's watching? Which I know that's the whole point of a replay. The moral story is I didn't, I didn't feel comfortable or confident. So I decided not to. Don't hate me. I, I didn't know. I didn't know. So all of that to say, it's been a little more than a week. We're going on week two that I have been living at the new spot, which is another reason why I'm using GPS to get home because there's two or three different ways that I could get home. And again, it varies from day to day. Some days route A is better, some days route B is better. I'm still unpacking, not living out of boxes, not as chaotic as I was. So there's progress there. It's about the same length and commute, which is annoying. But it is what it is the post office hates me because they are not delivering my mail so i'm in the process of trying to figure that out i wasn't aware that my mail wasn't being delivered because again it's only been a little more than a week but i try to get a package delivered just some replacement toothbrush heads of all the things and um they're like, yeah, nah, this address is vacant. We sending it back to the return to sender. I'm like, come on, man. So we're working on that. We're trying to, we're trying to get it together. Um, Lord, all of this construction. Oh, gas is 387. Finally, it's less than four dollars. Well, one thing that I know is on my notes. I'm um, so. What shows are y'all watching? I gotta go home and watch Snowfall. They got renewed for a sixth season, which will be their last. That's unfortunate. Snowfall is one of those shows where it took me a minute to get into it, but now that I'm into it, I'm in it, because it's a very slow start. So if you have been considering watching Snowfall, like I started and then stopped, and then one of my former coworkers was like, you gotta do it, it's a good show, it's a good show. And then eventually I was able to get it up, and now I'm semi-obsessed. So, I gotta go home and watch last night's episode. I was too busy watching, um, what's that show called? Married at First Sight. None of those couples are gonna make it. I mean, if any of them say yes on decision day, I will be shocked, but all of them need to say no. Katina needs to run for cover because that man is a hot mess. Um, all the couples are just bad. They're all bad and they all need to just say no on decision day and they need to go ahead and wrap the season up because because we tired we are tired what else am i watching abbott elementary their season finale is coming up which is unfortunate it's a very funny show um i can't think of anything else i'm watching hold on i'm coming up at a light Okay, so I said I hadn't been, I hadn't recorded all week, and I just, yeah, I looked at my stuff, and I was like, girl, you do not have enough for a vlog. My objective is to vlog now that I'm kind of, sort of getting settled. Honey, I packed my makeup for the, my makeup yesterday. I don't know what I've been doing in the interim. No idea. I've really just been filling in my brows, and that's it. More of the story is I unpacked my makeup yesterday, and. I didn't, I mean, I knew how much I had, but geez, I got a lot of makeup. I haven't really been buying makeup lately. I've been really into skincare, hence my uh, Ulta purchase. I have a majority skincare products in my cart. I did, I was bad and got something from the Sephora VIB sale, and it's majority um, skincare and hair stuff. What else, what else, what else? Oh, I was talking to y'all about, oh, so my objective is to vlog every other week and then try to bring back the whole purpose of me starting my YouTube channel years ago, which is makeup. So the objective is to vlog every other week. So it'll be like vlog, makeup, or something lifestyle related. Vlog, makeup, or something lifestyle related. That's the plan. We'll see how that goes. What else? 
Oh, I already said that. I meant to do one day Wednesday. Oh yeah, so I was, I was gonna record a video on Wednesday, which was yesterday, but yesterday was a blur. I worked, and the next thing I know, I was like, it's eight o'clock, you haven't eaten anything. And you need to start getting ready for bed at some point. And by the time I started to do all that, I was like, oh, you didn't record a video at all. So yesterday was very much a blur. I cannot account for that for that 24 hours. I, I, I can't account for it. I don't know. I got nothing. Oh, okay. And so for anybody who's curious, I'm kind of all over the place. Um, it is so different. I've lived on the top floor of an apartment before, so I know what it's like to not have people walking above you, but obviously that hasn't been my life for the past couple of months. So to live on the top floor again is refreshing. Obviously I don't have to deal with people walking above me and that's that means I can go to sleep with absolute silence and that's amazing. Now that I'm in this new spot, I am realizing that my neighbors like to play loud music. I was woken up, well, I was already in the process of waking up, like stirring, and then I could hear it more and more, and then that fully woke me up. Rock music, or I'm not sure what kind of music it was, but I could hear it. Because again, it's, it's dead quiet in my part, in my unit, whatever. But I could hear it from there unit below me does it, I don't know if that makes sense but whatever and I was like it's seven o'clock in the morning what why do you need to why is this how you start your day especially with it being as loud as it is it was crazy but not loud enough to the point where I wanted to stomp on the floor or do anything like that but still a little like hmm okay and then this morning I'm getting ready and I could hear music again I'm not sure if it was I think this one was coming from the guy next to me so it just seems like I got some very loud music lovers beneath and right next to me. So there's that. But as long as they're not blasting it at, you know, 11, after 11 o'clock or after 10 o'clock, because I'm getting old, ain't nobody got time. As long as they're not blasting it after 10 o'clock and not as early as 9 o'clock, although they were, because again, I, I'm up at 7 and I was like, why do I hear music? And... I know what you're thinking girl just get a house although I'm probably gonna have some complaints about that too whenever that happens because <laughs> I'm just like I just I want the amenities of the city uh, I want the amenities of living in the city in terms of things being in close proximity but I want the quiet of the country because I, I don't like to be near people because people means noise mm -hmm. people means noise so I would rather not be near people but also I don't want to have to drive 30 45 minutes to get to the mall if I ever go to the mall. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I want to go to Cheesecake Factory. Oh, wait, I got to drive 45 minutes traffic permitting to do that. No. I don't know if a place like that really exists, especially not in Atlanta. <sighs> okay, I really don't have anything much else to talk about, so I know this vlog is unconventional, but ain't that much going on. I guess I'll do my good deed for the day and let you go, unless you're going to go. Like, I'm being nice and letting you go and you're just going to sit there and look at me like I'm crazy. I'm trying to help a truck out. He ain't even getting in my lane. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Point is, I'm on my way home. I'm starving. I haven't eaten all day. That's nobody's fault but mine. Um, all of my food is frozen. I have chicken. It's in the freezer. I, I'm supposed to be cutting back on my fast food intake. That's not going well at all. I need to look up some recipes or something, or at least, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I need to figure it out. Okay, I'll go ahead and wrap it up. Thank y'all for watching. If you have any requests, like I'm a DJ, let me know what you want to see. And until my next video, I'll see you later. Bye.